Welcome. Welcome to the Psalms of Summer. Yesterday we asked, what are the cues that speak to us of the important relationship we have with God? And today, we will focus on the first of four such cues, God's goodness. Psalm 119 is a powerful example of God's goodness as seen in His law. All law, all law serves as a context for liberation. Honestly, look at any sport, music, art form, and we quickly see that if we stay within the laws of that activity, we can achieve great things, be it a baseball game, a symphony, or a swim meet. Yeah, laws can be seen as liberating, not confining. Ask any dancer, ask any musician, ask any artist. God's goodness by honoring God's laws is a remedy for my loss of enthusiasm for life in general. And so today, let's turn to our scripture, verse 10 of Psalm 119. It goes, I seek you with all my heart, do not let me stray from your commands. And so we enter the silence, breathing deeply to relaxation, and then quieting the mind of all distraction and thoughts with the simple words, let me not stray. Let me not stray. Let me not stray. These words, this verse, you can return to many times today and receive God's healing presence. So let us pray. Lord Jesus, you know my way all too well. Give me the courage not to stray, but to cling to your law. May I find within it the joy and enthusiasm of my youth that I may serve you more faithfully today. For your goodness to me, I give you thanks, now and forever. Amen. Blessings on your day.